So we are going to start with opening a new Scratch project. So if you have um, a Scratch account online, in case you want to use the online version, so yes, just open a new project. And if you are using the offline ver uh, version of Scratch, like you downloaded it, it's the same thing as well. So open um, a new project as well. Now we are going to delete this sprite. It's called um, the cut sprite. So let's delete the cut sprite. Once you've deleted that, you want to add a new balloon sprite to the to the presentation mode. Um, a new balloon sprite and also a backdrop. Okay, so let's look for balloon. Okay, so we have balloon. And let's also have a backdrop. So I'm going to be looking for a wall. Yes, so let's have this wall as our backdrop. Once you've been able to do that, give yourself a thumbs up. Next thing we're going to do is to add a code to our balance bike so that it can bounce around the screen. So I want you to come to your events and drag in when clicked when flag clicked so go to events when flag clicked so just drag it down next thing we want to do is to choose the direction in which the balloon should bounce so i want you to go to so you're looking for motion yes so when it comes to direction and movement so you're going to motion so i'm going you to drag go to x okay to this then now i want you to put zero and zero so when flag clicked go to x zero and y zero so that what what that means can someone tell me so what that means is that move my balloon to the center let the balloon start at the center now, next thing we would do is to choose the direction in which our balloon should go to. So now we want our balloon to point in a particular degree. So let's see, point to 45 degree. So point in direction 45 degree. Once you've been able to do that, the next thing we're going to do is to look for our forever loop. So once you've been able to set your direction of your balloon and how you want it to point, we're going to bring a loop that would then allow it to keep bouncing. So when you bring your forever loop, put it underneath as well, then go to your motion and click move 10 steps. But now you're changing it to move one step. So what that means is once you start, when I click the flag, start at the center and let the balloon point in 45 degrees. Then move one step. And if you get to an edge, you should what? Bounce back. So that's what we're looking for now. So if on edge, bounce. So let's look for if on edge, still on the motion panel. If on edge, bounce. So look at how I put it. So when flag clicked, go to X0, Y0, point in direction for five, and your forever loop, move one step, and if on edge, bounce. Okay. So now let's test out um, our balloon. So test your balloon, and let me know, does it move too slowly, or does it move very fast? If it moves slowly, then you can change the numbers on your code if you want to speed it up a bit. So let's test our balloon and see how it moves. So right now we see that the balloon um, flips as it moves around the screen. And that's because we put it to points in direction 45. However, balloons do not move like this, if you notice. Balloons are always straight up, right? So to fix this, what are we going to do? To fix this, we're going to click on the balloon spikes, which we're on. 
and we are going to click on the direction all right so this is the balance right that we're on so we're going to click on this direction so you can see it at the top here all right so um in order for the balloon not to rotate you need to click do not rotate right here so i'm going to um send that again i'm going to do that again so on the balloon sprite you're coming to your direction here all right so click on that and click do not rotate that's here so i'm going to click on my pen too so that we can see it properly so click on direction this and then click on do not rotate so that's what you are going to do once you've done that you would see that your balloon is now standing up straight so test it and let me know if your balloon is standing up straight while moving um in different left and right okay